Thanks for joining Magic 99.5 on this Giving Tuesday. Today is very exciting. We're doing Giving Tuesday with the American Heart Association of New Mexico. And we're lucky enough to have Sherry Wells. She's the executive director of AHA for New Mexico. And Dr. Andrew Harrell, he's an emergency medicine physician in the University of New Mexico School of Medicine. Thank you both for taking time to be with us today. Thank you for having us, Stephanie. Thank you. And first thing we want to say is that our donors have stepped up in a huge way today and are matching every donation. So whatever you donate today, that's going to get doubled. It'll be automatically matched. So it's a great day for a Giving Tuesday today. Um, let me ask you guys, uh, Sherry and uh, Dr. Drew, uh, what else is the American Heart Association doing uh, to make an impact in the lives of New Mexicans, especially uh, since the uh, COVID pandemic? Well, while the world's attention is still on the COVID-19 pandemic, the fact remains that more than 356,000 people will suffer in out-of-hospital cardiac arrest this year. Unfortunately, only about one in 10 live. Really? Oh, yes. my and that really underscores how important uh, what you do is. Absolutely. Yeah, and I think, Steph and Doug, that's it's really important for folks to realize, obviously the thing that is on everyone's mind right now, and we've touched on this a couple of different you know, times today on a couple of other segments is obviously the, the COVID-19 pandemic. But with, with the ongoing pandemic, one of the things that we've really seen is that people have, have unfortunately um, for, for whatever reason, continued, or I should say stopped getting the normal routine care. And we've seen a fairly significant increase in cardiovascular disease deaths. Um, and so uh, there are a lot of um, efforts and energy going into continuing the focus that the American Heart Association of New Mexico and the AHA around the world has really worked on, which is improving cardiovascular health and yeah. decreasing death from preventable disease. And it's really important for folks to realize that that's still very needed. One, uh, my doctor uh, really explained to me about heart disease and um, heart attacks, like it's the silent killer. Um, mm -hmm. And certainly they've got me on two medications to, to control my blood pressure, but women, I don't think women really understand the silent killer and that can be very dangerous. That's very Indeed. true. In fact, men have more heart attacks, but women die more often. More women die from heart attacks. Yeah, because we don't think it's worth going to the hospital. Oh, it'll, it's just a muscle cramp or I just lost my breath and it gets worse. So, so Steph, that's a perfect example of the, the Don't Die of Doubt campaign that the AHA has really been working on. And we yeah. want people to, to when you have symptoms that before the pandemic, you would have urgently or emergently sought out care for, you would have called 911 and you would get in the ambulance and you would let the paramedics take you to the hospital. Right, People right. need, yeah, they still need to do that. The things that were happening before the pandemic still occur. Don't die of doubt. If you think you're having a heart attack or a stroke, call 911, sure. go to the hospital. Obviously everyone's affected by the pandemic, but your health is still your health, just yeah. as if it wasn't going on. Mm -hmm. Yep, indeed. Exactly. Sharon, is there anything else uh, that you can add about the American Heart Association's participation here in Giving Tuesday? Um, I think we've covered almost everything. I, again, I just want to reiterate that, that the, the investments people make in the American Heart Association, especially on Giving Tuesday, are being doubled. Uh, it's like a two for one. It also, um, think about that if you're, you're considering your year end giving as well, could go a sure. little bit further. But, but honestly, the work that we do here on the ground in the school districts, in communities where there's high hypertension, those are the things that, um, that are being supported with generous donations. Right, yeah. and, and to think about it this way too, you donate $50 to the American Heart Association of New Mexico. Well, that's really a $100 donation and it's that easy. Everything is being matched today. Okay. And, we have, giving. and you're giving locally. You're thinking yes. about, we're all supposed to think globally, but act locally. This yes. is how you can act locally right now. You, all of your donations are getting matched. All you have to do is go to our website, magic995abq.com. Uh, Dr. Drew and Sherry, thank you so much for being with us today.
Thank you, Thank Doug, you. Steph. We appreciate it. Yeah, Thanks. we appreciate it. Thank you.